Growing up in Minnesota can instill in someone a love for hockey. That's true for longtime Sioux Falls hockey coach Bob Schmidt, who grew up playing the game in Crookston, Minnesota. And tonight's on Kel and Renee Ortiz looks at the impact Schmidt has had on hundreds of local kids through youth hockey. Every Thursday, close to 100 five- and six-year-olds hit the ice at the Shields Iceplex to learn the basics of hockey from head coach Bob Schmidt. I like working with the kids, being involved in the game, giving something back to the game. Schmidt started coaching youth hockey when he was attending Jamestown College in North Dakota. North Dakota did not have a hockey program, and uh, I decided uh, this was a good, good outlet to be be involved in hockey. He moved to South Dakota in 1975. It was then he began coaching the Adams in the Sioux Falls Youth Hockey Association. Skating is a big part of the game. I love to skate. But long before he began coaching, hockey was a part of his life. That's what it is. In Northern Minnesota, it's all about hockey. I just grew to love it. There was a level of passion that I think is kind of born in the blood um, when you come from Northern Minnesota and how big a part of hockey is in the culture there. Director of Hockey Dan Houck says it is that passion that allows Schmid to have such an impact on the kids. His attention to detail on the fundamentals of skating and player development and his ability to interact with the kids. Bob Schmidt has been coaching youth hockey for close to 40 years. In that time, he has coached hundreds of kids and even some of their parents. Bob coached and taught me when I was this age. A uh, girl playing with uh, his son, and now he's t coaching both of my sons. Aaron Peterson is the league supervisor for the Adams and also one of Schmid's former players. I've known Bob a long time. Um, I played hockey when I was uh, started about when I was four and Bob was coaching Sioux Falls Youth Hockey way back then. Now her daughter Josephine, who's known by her teammates as Josie, comes every Thursday. Because my grandpa did it and then my mommy and then I started playing. She plays alongside Schmidt's grandson, Ansel. I really like to go fast because I'm good at it. Ansel says he loves learning the basics of hockey alongside his grandpa. What's something new that you learned? Stop you. And this 75-year-old says he'll continue coaching because of his passion for the sport. I feel the most important thing that I can teach them is um, really just to love the game. To learn the skills necessary to play the game, more importantly, just to love the game. They're lessons that often last a lifetime. With Eye on Kelloland, I'm Renee Ortiz. The Sioux Falls Flyers are currently celebrating 50 years of youth hockey. Schmidt says it's been an honor to have coached for the majority of the league's existence.